Okay, I'll just show you how to delete a mobile from the Bluetooth audio system in this Discovery Sport, uh, 2015 Discovery Sport. So uh, from any screen, you've got settings over here. If you click on settings, you've got Bluetooth here. Or if you click on phone and there's nothing connected, you see here, no phone connected, connect a device now. Well, you don't want to connect a phone, so the tendency would be to click no. But what you have to do is click yes, and then you get this new menu, Bluetooth, search for Bluetooth devices, make system discoverable, list of paired devices, that's what we want, list of paired devices. And as you can see here, there's uh, quite a few phones in here. So you just select one, delete pairing, delete pairing, yes. Select another, delete pairing, delete pairing, yes. And there's mine, I want to delete that, delete pairing, yes. So that's it, that's it gone, easy as that. Okay, I'll just show you how to um, pair a mobile to the Bluetooth audio system in this 2015 Land Rover Discovery. First of all, we make sure Bluetooth is on, and then we're watching out at the bottom here. Over here, we go to telephone, click the telephone button, second up from the right. No phone connected, connect to device now, yes. We want search for Bluetooth devices, second one down, and it's found Discovery Sport here. Just wait for it to come up on there. Click on pairing Barry's iPhone. Please start pairing process on your device. If required, use this pin, naught, 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 naught. But it's generated, because we've done it from the vehicle to the device, it's generated a random uh, pin code. So we click yes there and yes there. Allow contacts and favorites to sync, allow. That's it, that's it paired. And, uh, just get notifications all over the place there. Other great thing with this system is if you go into your music, there we go. See there, Discovery Sport. I'm going to turn that down because I've just frightened myself to death when it came on before. But if you click the silver triangle with the three red circles at the, at the top, you see their iPhone or Discovery Sport. And uh, if there's no tick by Discovery Sport, just, just tick it there. We'll go back to the records. It's turned down, I'll click play. Now, with this phone set like that, whatever audio plays on there, whether it be a YouTube video audio, or Spotify, Amazon Prime, iTunes, whatever, the, the audio will come through this system in the Discovery. And it's a really, really good system. The sound's great. So now what we have to do, the, the music, the note symbol here and the clapperboard, we click on there. You've got source button at the top. Audio's off at the moment. So it's on radio at the moment. I'm going to turn that down. Click source again. And then it brings up the menu. FM radio, AM radio, Bluetooth auxiliary. Click on Bluetooth. That's the record that's playing on my phone. Um, now then, if I turn this up, like so, and then turn up from here. I can't play it too long or else I'll get a copyright strike, so. Click on play again, it stopped. Never do. <laughs> the audio system in here is really good. That That's how you do that. Okay, I'll just show you how to set the uh, sat nav in this 2015 Land Rover Discovery Sport. So, the circle here with the arrow in it, click on there. It's not showing you much at the moment, but if we click again, it gives you the screen where to. Click where to, enter postcode. We are Grosvenor Garage, Chorley Road. No, we're not, we've moved. We're Grosvenor Garage, Blackburn Road, Higher Walton, postcode P R five four E A. Again, great system in the Land Rover. Just once you've put that in, you just have to click select, calculated. and then confirm destination. Please that. follow the road for 1.5 miles. That's it. That's how you do it.